Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword Sandship Base Link Burst Skurvo Diorama figurine. So we'll get right into it. So this comes from First for Figures, guys. So if you are interested, um, done quite a few of these on the channel now. So just take a look at the box. They are nicely detailed. Um, lots going on on the outside. So very nice boxes. Even to just display the box is uh, quite impressive on a shelf. But uh, as you can see, they're quite large and take up a lot of space. So there's our box guys, what we're going to do, we'll pull it out and we'll get a closer look. So do let us know down in the comments what you think, and if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. So we're just going to uh, stand up for a little bit guys while I get this um, the foam protection out of the box, and then uh, just to make it a little bit easier for myself, because these things are normally quite heavy and large, make it difficult to uh, open and unbox, but um, I'll do the best job I can for you guys. So we'll just put that away. And here's our box, guys. So unfortunately, it's the wrong way up. So we'll get it around the right way and we check it out. So as you can see, guys, they've got the etching there on the phone, which is pretty cool and uh, impressive. And again, on this side, we've got our card to authenticate the uh, statue. This was uh, number 310 out of uh, However many they've made, I'm not too sure on the number of these ones, but uh, there you go. Pretty cool that um, they etch the uh, foam. They normally put um, the, uh, the uh, this side up, but I can't seem to see that on this uh, particular box, which is unfortunate. So um, we'll just uh, stick it this way. Okay guys, so we'll just cut the, uh, the tape off around the, uh, the middle of the package. And then it should just lift off and we'll be able to pull all the contents out. Package nice and tight, guys, to uh, stop any damage, which is always good, but just makes it slightly difficult to um, get everything out. So, we'll start with the base. Again, it's uh, in there quite tight. So, packing a bit of weight to that, guys, as you can see on the base, advertising first for figures, uh, what it is, and uh, the uh, number. So, like I said, 310. That's the top of it, guys. So nice wood looking base there to replicate the ship. Then we have our, um, we've got Skurvo here, which is the skeleton. So there's our Skurvo figurine, which will uh, attach shortly. Just get all the pieces out, guys. Take a look at those and then move forward. So like we have some sort of weapon here. So a sword there, probably for um, Skurbo. Next up, we have another item which looks to be for uh, Skurbo as well. So this piece looks pretty cool. So we've got some sort of chains and um, wooden posts there. So that'd be pretty cool to uh, put inside the uh, diorama and looks like we've got another set so possibly one for the uh, front one for the rear there okay guys and then here's our link from skyward sword blade in hand ready for uh, action with the uh, hyrulean shield and the master sword okay guys so I believe that's everything included. I'll uh, just get rid of the box and um, we'll start piecing it all together. Hopefully it doesn't take too long, guys. They don't uh, give you instructions with um, how these things normally go together. So it makes it a little bit difficult, but I'll uh, just cheat by looking at the box. So it looks like on the low side, we've got Link. And then on the high side, we've got uh, Skurvo. And then these, 
So a uh, so this is a color, guys, like a uh, I don't know a mustard there, and you're just going to match it with the, the color there, and then this will go into there. They are very tight, so that's pretty cool. Thought they'd be a little bit loose. But uh, they have a good effect being tight. And then we've got the green one, guys. So you want to stick him inside the green hole. And another one up there. Again, nice and tight, guys. And then we'll put Link down the bottom, like it shows in the picture. And you just slot the feet into the, uh, into the pins, guys. So this one's quite easy to uh, assemble. I've done uh, quite a few difficult ones, guys, uh, where they've had a whole bunch of different small pieces and you've just got to find the uh, slots for those all, which doesn't make it easy without instructions, but uh, it is what it is. So it looks like we've got our sword. So that will go into there. So you want that over there. Just got to uh, force this in a little bit, guys, but uh, that goes in there. Um, so it's facing upwards, and then I'm not too sure. Looks like that will slot in somewhere. But again, hard to tell. Okay, just looks like uh, it's the same actual sword, guys. So it could just be a uh, a spear because I can't seem to find where it goes. Doesn't even show you on the, uh, the picture there, so that doesn't make it easy. But um, there you are, guys. There's our diorama. We'll get rid of the uh, spare weapon there, and um, there you are. So you've got uh, Skurvo and Link battling it out on the. Um, on the uh, ship here so pretty cool diorama guys um, doesn't light up or anything this one um, but uh, there you are still a nice piece for the shelf like i did say guys though do let us know down in the comments what you think but that's everything included in today's box so do subscribe to the channel before you leave but for now we're going to conclude this part of the video Thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you leave, hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the dislike. Once we get to the next milestone, we're doing the next giveaway, so do subscribe if you're running for that, and we'll catch you next time.